PSLE 2019, Mathematics Paper 2. Time, 1 hour 30 minutes. Question 1. Write down A. The first common multiples of 4 and 10. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. So 10, 20. Answer is 20. B. All the common factors of 18 and 81. Question number two. In the figure, ACD and BCD are right angled triangles. By measuring a base and a height, find the area of triangle ABD. Give your answer to one decimal place. One. Take a ruler. Measure BD. This is the base, which gives us 3 cm. Then we measure AB. This is the height, which gives us 8.4 cm. Therefore, area of a triangle is given by half times height times base this gives us times base 4.2 gives us 12.6 Question 3 Mr. Raja started walking from home at 8.50 a.m. to the market which was 900 meters away. He walked at 75 meters per minute. At what time did he reach the market? Home to the market. 900 meters away at 75 meters per minute. He started at 8.50 a.m. So duration of his walk is 900 meter 75 meter per minute which gives 12 minute so 8 50 a.m plus 12 minutes will gives us 9 o2 a.m Question 4. City had a rectangular piece of paper, 35 cm by 24.6 cm. She cut out as many squares as possible from the paper. The side of each square was 5 cm. A. What area of the paper was left? Thirty-five length and twenty-four point six cm so if each cut out is 5 by 5 this side we can see that 20 cm will give us 4 squares and he will left with 4.6 cm so a area left is this area here 35 times 4.6 which gives us 161 centimeter square so this is 161 b 
how many squares did CT cut out? So for the lengthwise, with it is four length gives us seven. So number of squares. equals 4 multiplied by 7 is 28. Question 5. The solid below is made up of 5 cubes. A. Draw the front view of the solid on the grid below. We will only see this face, this face, this face and this face. Therefore, Stop. done. B. Susie painted the whole solid, including the base. Then she took it apart into its five cubes. What is the total number of faces that are not painted? Take that apart, we will find five cubes. So what we have, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10 over here, 10, so 10 sides. Question 6, the figure is made up of 3 squares, find angle X. So we have square, that means all are straight lines and all are of the same length and all are parallel. So this we have 1, 2, 8 degree. And same for here. 1, 2, 8 degree. And this is 90 degree. Angle X is given by angle in a point is 360 degree. So 360 degree minus 1 to 8 degree minus 90 degree. It gives us 142 degree. That's the answer. Question number seven. The bar graph shows the number of books read by class 6a from january to april the number of books read is not shown on the scale number of books read a what was the percentage increase in the number of books read from january to february so we know that january it has read one big scale two big scale marker and while February is three big scale marker and four big scale marker. So we know the increase is 100%. B. The average number of books read in a month from January to April was 75. How many books did class 6A read in April?
we know there is one two three four five marker six seven eight nine ten so each of these have a five marker ten marker therefore this is 15 this is 20 so January you have 10 marker February you have 20 marker March you have 8 marker April you have 22 marker so we don't know each marker is how many books but we have the average so 10 plus 20 plus 8 plus 22 per unit each of these unit this is one unit divided by 4 gives you 75 therefore one unit will be 75 multiply by 4 divided by 60 which gives you 5 and in April April we have 22 units gives you 22 multiplied by 5 which is 110 books Question 8. A box contained black beads and white beads. At first, the number of black beads was one third the number of white beads. After one quarter of the black beads end, three eight of the white beads are were used, 63 beads were left. A. What fraction of the beads were used? Leave your answer in the simplest form. B. How many bits were there in the box at first? We were given black equals to one third of white, which means black and white. No, this is one unit. Two, three, four. Which means black is one quarter of total. White is three quarter of total. All this is four over four. So A. one quarter multiply by one quarter because we was given one quarter of black beads were used gives us one sixteen this is black used so three quarter multiply by 3, 8 gives us 9 over 32 white used 1, 16 add by 9, 32 gives us 2 plus 9 over 32 which gives us 11 over 32 so fraction of the bits used B let's write down the answer first 11 over 32 how many bits were in the box at first so 32 minus 11 over 32 Right. gives us a fraction of 21 over 
32. And we know the remaining is 63 bits. That gives us 63 bits. Therefore, Sixty-three multiplied by thirty-two over twenty-one gives us ninety-six bits altogether. Question nine: The perimeter of figure A, B, C, D, E is ten p plus eleven cm. The perimeter of square. A, B, D, E is 12 cm. A. Find the perimeter of triangle B, C, D in terms of P. We were given A, B, D, E is 12 cm perimeter. Perimeter. So each side is 12 divided by 4 gives us 3 cm. So this is 3, 3, 3, 3 cm. So 10p plus 11 equals to 9 plus B, C, D. 9 because this shape. 9, B, C, D. And we have to minus 3. So just B, C, D. Without that 3 there gives us 6 plus 9. So BCD equals 10P plus 11 minus 9 plus 3 gives us 10P plus 5. B. The perimeter of figure A, B, C, D, E is 31 cm. What is the value of B? B. 31 cm equals 10 P plus 11. P will then be given by 31 minus 11 divided by 10 gives us two.